see you again. Those are beautiful. Yes. Now this is a whole other fabric. We wore them for my book signing. Oh, you did? Yes. For your did. book signing. How's your book doing? Is it doing it's well? It's doing good. Yeah, selling very well? Very popular. <laughs> Good, it's very popular. Very yeah, popular. No, I know, it did very well. And I understand uh, you have a, a, another little uh, tooth missing. Yes. So now that's your second tooth since you've been here. It only happens when you're in, in the United States, right? Uh-huh. Did you know I've lost two teeth in America? How can that be possible? I know. <laughs> it's just amazing. <laughs> it is amazing. So what did you, oh, did you bring video of pulling your tooth out? Yeah. Oh my, let's watch. It's pouring. It's absolutely pouring of blood. There's blood everywhere. What have you just pulled out? Hold your tooth up. Is that tooth number one or...? Number two! on my iPad. You always watch that on your iPad? How many times have you watched it? Like 15 times. 15 times? So what did you get? Did you that get... one's loose. You have another one loose now? That one. That's too many teeth you got loose going on there, girl. <laughs> did you get any money? Did the Tooth Fairy bring you money? And last time I got um, dollars, but this time I got coins, so it must be a different fairy. Oh. <laughs> They should talk to each other so it's the same rate all the time. <laughs> yeah. And I understand you went to go look at some dinosaurs. Did you go yes, to the museum? Yes, we did. And the man Robert was working very hard on cleaning the bones. And they were over 68 million years old. That was older than my grandparents. <laughs> and I was scared of the dinosaur. <laughs> it had horns. There it is. Do you remember the names of the dinosaurs? Um, Tyrannosaurus Rex, Triceratops, that's all I know. Uh-huh, that's what you know? <laughs> Look, someone's hands are there. Someone's hands is there. And, and did you have fun? Did you like that? <laughs> yeah, we loved it. Yeah? It looks like one of them elephants. It does, yeah, it it does, does look, look like, like one of them elephants. elephants. <laughs> um, and I understand you want a job in the museum, is that right, Rosie? Yeah, I used to want to be a cleaner, but now I want to be <laughs> a um, I really want to be a museum hostess. Imagine Rosie being a little cleaner in the house. <laughs> <laughs> so you rode the metro also? Yes, it was so much fun. It was much more fun than going in a car because it went so fast. And when we got there, there was a little lady laying on the floor of the subway. <laughs> so she might just be a little bit tired from travelling. <laughs> She was That's really right. funny. <laughs> yeah, she was probably just tired. Um, <laughs> and we have a board here because I understand, Sophia, you're teaching yourself tap lessons? Yes. So why aren't you taking tap lessons? Why? Because are... I think it will be better to make myself, I think it's important to be self-taught because I just like doing that. So instead of taking tap dancing lessons, you think it's better to be self-taught? Yes, I do. Okay, well, good. That's, uh, are you going to teach us what you, what do you know so far? I only know, do, 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 do. All right, well, let's, let's listen to your self-taught tap. So you now do you want to learn tap too, Rosie? Yeah. Yeah? I you, do know it, but I haven't done it for years because I used to You go, haven't done it for years? Because <laughs> I used to go ballet dancing, but then I You changed over to tap? Yeah. I see. And then I changed you don't I was too li and big, so I had to go to school. Well you had a full, full life. Um, and I I know uh, there's something that we, we always surprise you with things. We always send you places that are fun, right? Yes. And today I'm surprising you. Your whole family is gonna go you've been to Disneyland before, now you're gonna go to Disney World. We're gonna send you to Florida and you're gonna go to Disney World. How about that? You're welcome. And there's one other thing that you've always wanted, and that is you wanted to get slimed. Is that right? Yes. Well, we're going to take a break. <laughs> <laughs> uh, 
I wouldn't be this close to you if that was going to happen. Because <laughs> that's not a dream of mine. But we, we're going to take a break. And when we come back, you're going to get slimed. You're really going to get slimed. You went, how was Disney World? It was amazing because we actually got to perform on the stage in front of the castle for Merida's coronation. And Merida turned up on a horse. Uh, really? It was, it was the most like, magical performance. It was ever. like um, 100 million people there. Yeah, I forgot to say, there was like over a thousand people there. Over a thousand? More than a million. Oh, mo <laughs> more than a hundred million, though. Yeah, yeah. Wow. All right, let's take a look I'm at what I'm so ha excited to watch it. Okay. <laughs> Here we go. Me too, let's watch it. I can just see the castle. Look at it. Look at the castle. My daughter. Now she's a real princess! Hi. Merida! Merida! <gasps> Hi! Hello! Ah, you girls look so brave today in your dresses. Did you know you're my new favourite character? Is that right? Yeah? yeah? Do you like it? Yeah. yeah. You're a very special princess because you're brave. That's right, that's right. What makes you brave? Once I touched a little spider and I don't like it really. Yeah? You've I've... got your bow and arrow. You do? And I can shoot you. <gasps> well, perhaps you could show me? Yeah? Well, let me go grab mine, all right? Okay. Okay, I'll see you in a second. She's very brave and very confident. I wonder how she washes all that hair. That might be very hard. Yeah, because it might get all like soggy and frizzy in the bar. Sophia Grace, Rosie, where'd you go? Oh, surprise! Oh, 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 you got a hair like me! Yeah. Just like that. And release it. Yeah! Oh, that's great! <laughs> yeah! They're natural, they think. I got it! Yeah! I that's great. I got it in a target! Remember what I told you about being brave, all right? One more hug then. Oh, thank you. Now I'm going to shoot it the hardest I've ever shot it. <laughs> nice to meet Bye. you. Bye. Bye, girls. That was the best shoot I've ever done. We are back with Sophia Grace and Rosie. And have y'all ever been to Las Vegas before? Nope. No. I was thinking about sending you there because this weekend there's something really special going on. There's the Billboard Awards, you know that? Yeah. So we want you to go cover the red carpet for us at the Billboard Awards in Las Vegas. And I'm going to get you tickets. You can go inside and see the show after you do the red carpet for us. And because you're going to be in Vegas, you know, it's, it's an adult town, so you're going to need these. I got your fake IDs. <laughs> Because when you're in Vegas, you have to change out. Thank you. <laughs> you want to put it on? All right. How's that? Yeah. <laughs> I don't want to take this off. No, I don't want to. How's that? Look at that. Yeah. <laughs> oh, the lovely old love seat. Ah, oh, the lovely old love seat. Usually you're just in one chair, yeah, but now, now you're... we're going to like the big seat. You have a whole lot of room. <laughs> well, you look. 
You look beautiful. Again, you always have Thank such pretty you. dresses on. Okay, so let's talk about Vegas. This was your first time, and, and what did you think of Las Vegas? It was just so good. I really wanted to gamble, <laughs> but you can't bet when you're under 21, so... If I did gamble I'm on a million dollars, then I'd get my family to America and buy a pink car. Oh, it's a shame you didn't gamble. That would have been. Yeah, I didn't want to. That's what, well, you'll come back and you'll gamble another time. Rosie, did you like Las Vegas? Yeah, really much, really. Yeah. Would you change anything about Las Vegas? I would change, like, well, I've got the vibe that it's a little bit like for adults. <laughs> it's for adults, as you can see. Yeah. So while the adults are having fun gambling, we're just bored, so they can have a little colouring table while the adults are gambling. Does, yeah, well, that would be nice to have some colour. That is just so fun. <laughs> yeah, we were tired at night and the mums are getting yeah. drunk and stuff. <laughs> <laughs> really? It's normally the dads, but it was the mums. Yeah. Really? <laughs> And you went to the uh, Billboard Music Awards. What was your favorite part about that My show? My favorite part was like Madonna. When she came out, she's so famous, she's so pretty. She showed her knickers on stage. Um, <laughs> it was a little weird, but that's Madonna, and she's just nice. You've got a point there. All right, well, let's take a look at the tape piece, OK? OK. All right. Okay. sell that on eBay. Yeah. yeah. It's tea time. It's Sophia Grace. I'm Rosie. <laughs> I love it. Today our guest is LL Cool J. Glad to be here. We're wearing your necklaces. Yeah, I see. They look really, really pretty on you. You guys look like two princesses. Mm -hmm. Two future queens. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you gave us them on the Grammys. Yeah, yeah. I gave them to you at the Grammys. You were on the carpet, and you guys were looking really pretty. And, and you asked me a lot of so sparkly and all diamonds. Yeah, they're all Love sparkly it. and beautiful, and they look nice. Don't you think so? Yeah. You see? Like, <laughs> <laughs> I really love this. Yeah, it's really nice. You look really good in it, too. Mm -hmm. Like those braces? Yeah, I like that one. You like the sparkle. I love yeah. that one. You like the sparkle? I like the chain. Yeah, let's all, let's pretend we're having our tea and make a toast. Okay, oops, I'm sorry. You ready? Thank you. Can I have a little sippy sippy? A mm -hmm. little sippy? <laughs> a little sippy? <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's delicious. Now that is some good tea. It's the best tea I've ever had. Wow. Who's your favorite celebrity you've ever met? Well, I thought Michael Jackson was really, really cool. We've always wanted he was to cool. meet Michael Jackson. Um, Ellen is really cool. I've met, who do you like? You. You like yes. me? Yeah. I'm the coolest celebrity. Yes. Give me a high five on that. See, that's what I'm talking about. Put an L up in the air. L L Cool J. Say it with me. L L Cool J. 
<laughs> Love that. Mm. So, uh, have you got a hidden talent? A hidden talent? Um, yeah, yeah. I, I can juggle a little bit. Okay. You know juggling? You yeah. Know, you yeah. Know, I can juggle. I can juggle. You have any? Um, you got three? Oh, there's three. Three oranges. Three. oranges you can okay. juggle. Yeah, I can. I, I can try. I don't want to hit you though. Just back up a little okay. bit. I don't want them bouncing you to your little tiara or something. All right, so just do that. Whoa! You know, you know, and it's... That is really good. It's OK. <laughs> oh, I go back backwards. Oh. I have a hidden talent. What's yours? Look. Dancing man. Go like this. Oh, that's it. You can do the movement, too. That's <laughs> 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 so It's so funny. <laughs> <laughs> move, move. That's cute. You're so cute. <laughs> Both of you. I'm glad that you let me be on your show. And let's all have an orange. Okay? You have Thank one. you. Or a tangerine. These are tangerines. Thanks, LL Cool J. This has been Tea Time with mm. Sophia Grace and Rosie. <laughs> Thank you, Sophia Grace. Thank you, Rosie. I truly appreciate you guys. You're very pretty, and you're my favorite talk show host. See you later, okay? Okay. Thank you. Oh, let me have one more sip of tea. All right, one more sip. Mmm. LL Cool J. Say it. LL Cool J. There you go. See you later, baby. I'm so excited to be back. I'm so excited to have you. You're almost getting to the point where you're going to need separate chairs. I think we are because, I mean, these dresses are just gigantic. <laughs> hey, do you know? It's been two years now since you were first on the show. You were on the show two years ago for the mm -hmm. first time. I know. I can't believe it. It's been, it, it flew by, right? Mm -hmm. So the two year anniversary, you know, every year there's a certain gift that's associated per year. Mm -hmm. And uh, the second year is China. So I got y'all a little tea set oh, so you can thank have you tea. So much. And there's your faces on the little, look at that. Be able to have your little tea set. Tell me what's been going on. Tell me how your summer is. Well, it's been so great in my summer. It was actually quite hot. I'm going to run it. We went to. I went to Greece with my baby cousin Delilah and my boy cousin Ronnie, mm -hmm. and I really enjoyed it. And I did these things called high ropes, and it was at the kids club. And you like go on the high ropes, and you like hang on to stuff, and you like walk around. It's really high up there. I am. Wow. Some skateboard, and I felt a little bit oh, so nervous, but I loved it in the end. <laughs> and at one point, my feet couldn't reach the bottom, so I had to hold on. And there's my cousin Ronnie uh -huh. behind me. In the background. Yeah, this really... Wow, what's the point of that? What are you doing there? What um, kind of vacation like, is that? around and stuff. It's, it's, it, was it it's scary or no? Yeah, you don't get I scared. So, I, f I felt a little bit scared. Though. A little bit scared up there. But I heard you went on a ride at Disneyland, and, you, and the, were you scared or not on those rides? Um, no, definitely not, but my cousin Brooke was. Mm -hmm. We went on the Tower of Terror, we went on Space Mountain, we w went on the Massahorn. Uh, they were like so scary, but it was really fun. It was fun, you weren't that yeah. scared. No, I wasn't, but my cousin Lily was laughing in the Tower of Terror picture. Uh huh. <laughs> And then there was a big storm in England, right? Oh, yeah, it was very big. It wasn't as big. There used to be one in 1987 or 78, but it wasn't as big as this. <laughs> um, I, the rain was so loud. I was sleeping at my nan's house that night, and when we got back, there was a tree behind our garden. It, like, bends. It goes, ah. But I thought it was going to fall over, but it didn't. Poppy's kennel was flown over in the garden. I mean, chairs were everywhere, but luckily Poppy was in. I would not put an animal out in that weather. I mean, it was unbelievable. No. Yeah. <laughs> I got some of that. Some Poppy's what was almost blown over? Poppy? Like her little house she's in the garden. She has a house, house in the garden? Okay, but Poppy was inside. I would and like the storm was not oh, as... Oh, there she is! Yeah. Poppy! Poppy! Yeah. Oh, there's a tent! I know. There she is. Yeah. She's That's really naughty. I bet that tent got blown around in the... Yeah, the but the storm did. wasn't as bad as the one in 87, you said? No. Nah. That's great. I think it was All right. Awesome. Rosie said she can't sit down because the tutus are too big I and know, they're squishing they're, up they're against it. That's the, that's the problem. That's why I don't wear a tutu, because sometimes it's hard to sit down like that. And they're very itchy, but they're very nice. Yeah, but they are. They're beautiful. Them. And you're back in school, right? Yeah. What are y'all learning in school? Um, 
Well, I've been learning quite a lot of things as I'm homeschooled right now, but my favourite lesson, I like art because I've been very good at drawing and I've done a few drawings. I saw stuff. some, they're very good. Let's look at some of the drawings that you have. That's at the beach, that's uh -huh. me and Rosie, uh -huh. that's a mermaid. That's Danielle, mummy on the chairs. And you that's have your Daddy microphones at the beach, it looks like. Yeah, Is that's that right? ice cream. Oh, it's an ice cream. <laughs> All right. And, and then... That's going to a meet and I had to do Rosie and Danielle's hair pink so I didn't have a yellow. Uh -huh. That's in LA. That's, all the that's amazing. And where's that? Is that a bar? Um, that's a bar. Daddy and Greg, my dad and Greg, two and Ken, of course. So you, you, <laughs> you drew them at a bar? Mm -hmm. Uh huh. That's exactly what the bar looks like at the uh -huh. Lane Hotel. What were they drinking? What kind of beverages? Beer. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I see. And Rosie, what are you doing in school? What do you like? We're learning about le le electricity. Electricity? Yeah, and there's these see-through little bulbs, like that small. Right. And there's this little carton that you screw it into. That you have to get two wires and one battery. And you pu put the first wire onto the battery and the light bulb. Yes. Then you get the second one onto... The do it the same. If if the bulb doesn't light up, then the battery's run out of electricity. If it does light up, then it's not run out of electricity. That's what you're learning. Okay. So, well, that's great. So that's basically how electricity works. We're learning yes. about that. That's great. Do you like art as well? Yes. Do you draw as well? We both draw mm -hmm. a lot of stuff. A lot of stuff. Mm -hmm. And then, and you got your braces off, I noticed. Yeah, I got the braces off. Uh -huh. um, there's my brace, and there's Bobby! Oh. That's my braces. I sent that to Daddy so I could send it to the shy. So that's Poppy, that's your cat that you just showed us. And, and you have a, a pet too, Rosie. Who do you have? I have, um, I have a pet hamster, and her name's Fluffy. Fluffy? And the first step... Uh -huh. She lets me stroke her. Uh huh. Then she poppy. Oh. Uh. Yeah. I don't. Oh. That's sweet. Let's look at it as a sweet poppy, thing. Please. That's you good. Do not hurt Fluffy. She's All so right, cute. you two. Well, I, I love seeing you, and I'll see you again soon. Okay. Mm -hmm. Let's not make it so long next time. Okay. All right. Oh. <laughs> you both look adorable as always. And I hear you have very exciting yes, news. Yes, it's very exciting, I'm going to tell you. OK. Both of our mums are pregnant. pregnant. Yay! Are you going on your camera, Mom? Yeah. Danielle and Carly, hi. Congratulations. And this, um, you've been, so you've been excited. Wishing... I've been wishing every birthday, and it's finally come true. Like, yes. I mean, if it was a girl, we could dress in pink leotards and tutus, and it would be really good. But if it was a boy, we could still dress it nice, couldn't we? Yeah, I like it. Sparkly blue belt and like an LA sparkly cat and a diamond dummy. <laughs> blue diamonds, though. A diamond what? Diamond dummy. Oh, like a uh, pacifier. pacifier. Yes. Pacifier. Yes. <laughs> um, we no, call so it I'm, dummy in England. You have been, yeah, they're dummies, but, and they're the things you suck on. Them. Yeah. yeah. So, and but you've been wanting this, I know, a long time. Know, you wish that I all mean, the time. Rosie, so have you always wanted to have a brother or sister? Yeah, I've been waiting for this my whole life. So <laughs> I'm just so excited to hold a baby that's actually my sibling. Yes. Brother or sister. And are you, do you both want, it doesn't matter if it's a boy or a girl? Mm, well, I did want a girl, but if it's a boy, it doesn't really matter. As long as I've got one, it's yeah. okay. <laughs> and Rosie, boy, girl, doesn't matter? Mm, doesn't matter. No, I really want a boy, though. What are you going to name them? Um, well, we'll probably get to name them. Oh. But if it was a girl, I'd probably call it maybe a flower or something, even Rose or Daisy or anything like that. But I don't have a clue for what, a boy. What about Ellen? Ellen? Yes. Maybe for like a middle name or even a first name. That's right. Ellen? Yes. But I don't have a clue for a boy, do you? No, not for no. a boy. No, I don't either. <laughs> no. Any names, Rosie, for a girl? Yeah. Um, my mum doesn't really know what names, but... Uh -huh. I would call one, like, Rainbow or Sparkle, but if it was a boy, uh -huh. 
I don't have a clue. You don't have any boys' names ready? So we must think of some boy names. It's quite hard. Just in case. Well, start thinking just in case. You have plenty of you have some some time to think about it. And I I hear that you have advice for me because you found out I'm hosting the Oscars. Yeah, that's going to be so good for you. I mean, always smile. Always smile, and you need to make up a good speech and wear a nice. Suit. A nice suit. Mm -hmm. uh, that's what I was planning. A nice suit. I was thinking about writing a speech. I thought I should have something to say. Mm -hmm. And I think I'll smile a lot. Rosie, have a, advice for me? Yes, you have to wear like a black and white stripy top and some nice jeans. Oh. Or mm -hmm. And if, um, and this is what they have to say if, um, they don't win and the other ones win, just be happy because you don't know because the next time you might win. Exactly. That's good advice. And just to be nominated is an honor, right? I know. Yeah. So, and I understand, uh, you are you know, you're very famous. People really like you a lot. So now mm -hmm. when you're out in public, I, I understand you have paparazzi following yes, you. Yes, there's lots of paparazzi. And on the way, because it was like a Christmas Santa got out at the Grove, um, but that doesn't bother you that the no. paparazzi want to take pictures. No, I actually like it. Yeah. <laughs> you have exciting news. You want to tell everybody what you're about to do? Yes, okay. we are. We're going to go to South Africa to film our home movie. They're filming a movie. That's their very first movie. And, um, well, um, the movie's about, like, um, well, there's, like, a... There's a king, and then he's giving down the crown to three princesses. There's either Cordelia or Abigail or Imogen. But Abigail wants to be the queen, but she's just a bit boyish uh -huh. and stuff like that. So we're going to help her get the crown, and we're also going to go swimming and have fun in the sea, but not too close to the sharks. <laughs> now, will you be there for the holidays, or where will you be for Christmas? Um, we'll be there two days before Christmas. What will you do for Christmas? Are you excited about um, it? I'm really excited about Christmas, but next year's Christmas will be even more exciting. There'll be two new family members. Yes, It'll you'll have so a brother exciting. or sister. <laughs> yeah, that's going to be really fun, right? Yeah. <laughs> And have you, have you sent letters to Santa yet to yes, ask for things? Yes, we have sent letters to Santa, and I wrote to him. I said, like, um, I'm writing this letter early because I'm not going to be here. I'm getting back two days before Christmas. <laughs> and I wrote all of it. Oh, that's my letter! Yeah. That's my letter. <laughs> and I drew them two little snowmen as me and Rosie. Oh, that's great to think ahead. And in the hand with the brown-haired one, there's actually a microphone there. Right. And there's Rosie's one. And, and Rosie, it's what really did you, nice. you wrote to Santa also? Yes. Uh, uh, what'd you ask for? Um, I asked for Orbi's foot spa. A foot spa? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's like a salon. It's like a salon. salon. Foot spa. It's really good. How old are you? Seven. Seven, and you asked for a foot spa? It's like it's actually like for kids. You just pour these beads in a little thing, like a little yeah. container, and no, then they turn good. into balls. No, it's them. good to take care of your feet early on. It's really um, nice. <laughs> Hey, I, you know what I wanted to ask you is, what shows are you watching on television when you're here? Do, um, you, do you watch TV? Yeah, we watch TV. I watch Sam and Cat. I love Sam and Cat. I like Good Luck Charlie, Jesse, Austin and Ali, the vlog. And I just like... Channels. What do you like, Rosie? <laughs> um, I like Friends. Friends. I love... <laughs> um, <laughs> what do you like, like about Friends? Um, I just like... Three characters like Phoebe, Joey, and Rachel. What do you like about each one of them? Rachel's pretty. Phoebe goes a bit crazy, but Ra um, and but not in real life, and she's pretty. And Joey cheats on girls. <laughs> I don't. I'm not you don't watch that? No. Yeah. You'd like it. I think you'd enjoy it very much. She, you would. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'm, I'm actually it. <laughs> oh God. Um, so I heard you all have a little uh, secret handshake. Is it do you're going to um, teach me, or do you do yeah, it with each well, other? We'll do it now, and then we can like do it. Okay. So you go one, two, okay. mm -mm, twelve. What up? And we can do it with you. If you okay. Like a, I'm going to so stand up though. Okay, Wait, how so are we going to do it? One. one Two, two three, and then twelve, and what up? Yeah. <laughs> Fantastic. All right.
That's our secret. Yeah, so when we see each other, we'll do that. <laughs> Lovely ladies, how are you? I'm really excited to be here. Excited to have you back. <laughs> Always exciting. Now, the last time you were here, you said that uh, your dreams had come true. You'd been wishing yes, that your moms would get pregnant, so you had a brother or sister, yes, and now both of your moms are pregnant. You're going to have a brother or a sister. Mm -hmm. And so I got you a gift. So if it's little girl, I have these. Wow. Okay. Oh, Isn't that cute? If it's a little boy, <laughs> I got me. We can't still put it anywhere. Yeah. So you won't, I mean, of course you can. Why not? It would look funny though. All right. Well, cute. now what are you going to wish for? Because your dreams came well, true. What are you so going to? I I really want to swim with dolphins, like in the sea or a swimming pool or something. I just think they're so <laughs> cute. They never hurt you. They wouldn't. Mm. And I just really love they them so much. And then they go really cute. Mm -hmm. they what go, do they sound like? Ah, wait, what is it? Something like that. They're just yeah. squeaking. Yeah, yeah, like a know. squeaking yeah. noise. Is yeah. that what you want to do, Rosie? You want to swim with dolphins? Yeah, I just love them. Mm, yeah, I want to swim with dolphins. And I've got, there's these roller skates. And they're, they're not actually roller skates. They're shoes, but they've got They've got like wheels on your heels. Yes. So, and it, it, all of a sudden you're walking and then it goes. <laughs> so it's all. They're like, called heelies. Yeah. And like, they're really that good. Seems I like a, that seems like a dream that could come true pretty easily. You just buy those things. You, they, they're yeah. really good. They have them. And you went to hang out with Britney Spears. Was that today? Oh, that was really good. We got to rehearse with her. We learned a little dance routine that she was doing. It was really good. I think we have B-roll of that. Let's see what you, you and Britney and... Did you have fun with her? Yeah. We had Look a at lot that. Of fun. Oh. <laughs> she taught you some new moves. Because she's getting ready for that Vegas show, right? Look at that. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Very impressive. And Very impressive. Yeah. Really good. You when mean, we saw her, saw her here at the Ellen Show backstage, she was all like wearing really nice clothes, but she was a casual Britney today because she was rehearsing. But she can't be casual because we wore pajamas once when we were rehearsing last night. <laughs> oh, was really yesterday good. Um, and last night. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. You were yeah. in pajamas. Yeah. Y'all wearing pajamas? In, like. Shorts and like a t shirt, and I was yeah. just in my pajama bottoms and my t my top. That's okay yeah. <laughs> that's if you're rehearsing, that's okay. And you went to a trampoline, uh, like a whole area that oh, has that was the whole amazing. floor, right? It's called Sky Zone, and there was trampolines on the floor, on the side, and you got to do flips. And there was this spongy bit too, it's like cube squares that are squishy, and then you land in, and then and that's then me you, coming out, and then yeah. you land in them, and I got stuck, and uh, I went, <gasps> Wait, oh. this is the good bit. Uh, we oh, and then you can play basketball and yeah, everything. Yeah, that was really good. Y'all are very busy but girls. That was really good. All right. Hi, Ellen. It's Sophia Grace and Rosie, and we're at Britney Spears rehearsals. We're going to get a big surprise for her. Come on, let's go. Oh, I'm really excited. We're actually the first ones to meet Britney, I think. Oh, why? Yeah. Britney's going to be really nice tonight. She's your husband. Hi. 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 Your dresses are beautiful. Are you doing my choreography? Yeah. Oh, my gosh. Happy birthday. Yeah, I love Thank this. you so much. Usually before we do a dance, we put our hands together like this. Yeah, I'm seeing that. And then afterwards, we give each other five. And we're like, way to go. One, two, three. Peace of me. me. that you're growing up so much that we have to bring a couch out. Usually you share Our a chair. Our dresses are just getting too big. It's <laughs> I've just missed coming here so much and I just, I really love it here. And even though I'm far away from home, I still feel like I'm at home here just because it's so relaxing. Ah, oh, well that's sweet, Sophia. That's so sweet. You both look so pretty and you keep just getting prettier and you're growing Thank up you. so fast. <laughs> Rosie, you look like you've, how, you, have you grown? Um, yes, I've grown one, 
half an inch in a month. That's what I thought. Oh, you no. seem you seem a half an inch taller. So, <laughs> uh, and I heard you have a loose tooth. Am I? Is it yeah. in the front? Which yeah. one is it? Uh, How loose is it? Oh, that's real loose. Very loose. Oh, that's but very. My teeth say no. They just won't come out. They stuck to my gum, and they won't. Like none of them are wobbly, and I'm almost eleven, and they're just not wobbly. I just don't get it. I'm, well, I don't get it either. You haven't lost one tooth? No, I have lost. I've lost eight teeth. Oh. But I've still got a few to go. You have a few to go, and you're eleven. And you have you lost any teeth yet? These two, got these two, and I'm losing that one. And now you're losing that so one. I'm almost losing that one. Do you want to? <laughs> and do you want to pull it out or anything? You want to do it now? I would if I could, but um, the only way I could get it out is bang it on a wall or um, get a brick and bang my face with a brick. Well, no. <laughs> those, those are not the only two options, Rosie. That's. <laughs> Or just get a piece of string tight to Yes, your, okay, um... there's other options. Please know that, okay? <laughs> Let's just let it fall out on its own, okay? Mm -hmm. oh, now, I out. heard, Sophia, you're making potions. Well, yeah, I like to relax in the bath, and <laughs> it's really funny. I love I, a bath. Isn't start, the bath nice? I love baths. I used to hate them. Now I love them. Oh. Anyway, mm -hmm. I just, like, with my shampoo and my body wash, I put them all together. Sometimes it goes pink, sometimes it goes blue. But I make bubbly potions, and I thought if I drink them, they'll taste disgusting. But also, if I drank them, They'd make me shrink or even go into a fairy or a mermaid and go into a magical bubble world. Well, <laughs> well it, if you drank it, you would think those things anyway because. <laughs> because no, that would actually happen. It you would, would hallucinate, just, and you would think you're. It will you, probably just make your stomach really hurt. Yeah, you don't want to do that. But it's nice that you make potions. Yeah. Do you enjoy a bath, Rosie? Really enjoy it, really. Yeah. <laughs> I play with this sieve thing. Like a sieve. You do what? I play with um, like a sieve or something. A sieve? In yeah. the tub? Yes. What a wonderful toy. <laughs> um, <laughs> here's your sieve. Go play in the tub. <laughs> I think people are spending too much money on toys now. <laughs> and you like the Titanic? Yes, I like it because there's um, a woman called Rose and I'm called Rosie, so um, we're both similar. Yes. And I like it where Rose ends up on an island. Is that what happens at the end? Yeah. Okay. But they um, meet again. <laughs> <laughs> so Rose ends up on the island. That's great. So there'll be a, a sequel, maybe, to Titanic. <laughs> uh, there should be a Titanic 2. There should be a really Titanic 2. Sure. That would be. Titanic 2. We oh, should start writing that right now. Um, <laughs> So the last time you were here, I'm so excited about your movie that's coming out because it is really, really good. You're both I, really wonderful so actresses. Excited. And you went to South Africa to film it. How was it that? It was so fun filming it and just getting to know what it feels like to be actresses. And it was really fun filming the movie. And we got to do our own stunts. And in the actual film, there was two princesses who were really horrible called Princess Cordelia and Princess Imogen. But in real life, they're really, really yeah. nice. <laughs> Look at you and on the pigeons. ledge. Oh. And pigeons. And there's pigeons. And yeah, it's a really, I think it's a really good movie. And I think you're good actresses. And um, I'm excited for everybody to see I'm really it. I'm really excited yeah. to watch it. All right, we're going to take a break. When we come back, we sent you to the Nickelodeon's Kids' Choice Awards. And uh, we're going to take a look at what happened there. Did you have fun? I had so much fun. Yeah. I loved watching everyone. We didn't actually get slimed, but I had fun watching other people get slimed. Great. <laughs> good. Rosie? Um, it was really good and I felt really confident because I was with a person who was actually a real person that was on an actual film <laughs> in Big Time Rush. Oh, well, that's a big deal, huh? <laughs> yeah. All right. Uh, let's just take a look at the, at the piece that you did at the Kids' Choice really Awards. Excited. Okay. This is amazing. We're just about to do a dress rehearsal. by posing in his knickers. <laughs> I think our mums like him. Ooh. Ellen, we're just about to walk down the orange carpet and this is the first time that we're actually going to be interviewed. This is the best day ever! <laughs> this is the first time we've actually seen it.
<laughs> you just got slammed. How did that feel? Oh my gosh, it was crazy. But it didn't get on my face. Do you see this? Makeup still perfect. And um, why is it slime pink? You know what? That is the greatest question ever. It's why green it and cold. Pink? Why can't it be pink and warm? You know what? You're so right. Your favorite is Frozen. Those are the best. Thank you. tell you something about you two. Uh, you've been with us for so many years and you're still the same sweet girls that you were when I first met you and I like that you're not changing and that you're staying exactly just down to earth little girls because you need to remain that because you're going to be big big stars but stay <laughs> sweet because this is going to be really really popular. People are going to love this. Hello you two. And the bigger you get, the wider the little uh, tutus are. So we're going to have to get a longer couch someday because you're going to just spread out completely. This is a beautiful little dress as I'm well. I'm so excited to be back. I'm so excited to have you back. It's always lovely to have you here. And since you've been here, uh, Rosie, you, you lost a tooth. Yeah. Look at it. It's gone. <laughs> how long after you you were here, how did it fall out? Did you pull it out? Um, no, my dad, um, just it was really loose. So uh -huh. my dad just touched it, uh -huh. and he pushed it back a little, and it popped out on the and, floor. <laughs> oh, that's great. And did the tooth fairy come and leave you some money? Um, yes, he bought me four... Five American dollars and um, 25 pe um, pence. 25 pence? Cents. 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 Okay. <laughs> Ten cents. Five dollars and 25 cents. Yeah. So just a little extra, a little over the five dollars. That's nice. Yep. Did you spend it already? Um, no, I haven't, but I'm going to get all my cousins, like Sophia, Ronnie, Delilah, Lily, Brooke, um, and... So me some. What are you, you going to get for five dollars and twenty-five cents? For <laughs> I'm going to. What are you going to get, get, everybody? Some sweeties for all my cousins. Ah, that's so nice of you that you're going to, and then more teeth will fall out because you're going to give them <laughs> some sweets. <laughs> <laughs> this one will fall out. It's not that wobbly. Yeah. Oh, yeah. don't do that. Don't do that. It's, <laughs> it's not wobbly. Okay, let's not just wobbly leave that one alone right all. now. Okay. Um, and congratulations. I heard you found out if you're having brothers um, or sisters. Well. I've already got my wish to have a baby, um, a baby. Because you wanted a baby. But my second wish to have a baby sister, and it came true. You're I having a baby sister. You're having a baby sister. I, I was so excited that we was in the room, and I found out it was a girl, and I was like, Jumping up and down, screaming. I was so excited. I just could not believe it. Oh, that's so good. And Rosie, did you get your wish too? Yes. What are you um, getting? I got a boy. You got you got a boy. So you have a brother. It's just so, it's so weird that we actually got our wishes. Like, it's not magic. We got what we wanted. I know. Well, it's so weird because you've been talking about it since you were on the show that you wanted and that both of your moms got pregnant at the same time and that you're going to have a little sister and a little brother. And what will you do with your little sister? Um, I'm going to change it. I'm going to dress it. And I'm going to bath it. I might even have a bath with it. And I like it when they wake up in the morning and they have milk breath. Because they breast lots of milk. And um, it's going to watch baby TV with me. Even though I don't like baby TV, I like my baby sister. So that's what I have to do. Wow. <laughs> you're, you don't need a nanny. You all of a sudden have a nanny built in. That's amazing. And Rosie, what will you do with your little brother I um, um. you wrote something is this what you're doing this because yeah. I, I found this do you want to read it you, you wrote a law right yes um it's called the McClelland law right because my um, first name is McClelland no my second name right no, my last name Yes. Um, so it goes like this. I promise to do my best to help my mum when she's pregnant and to help the king and queen and to keep the McKinnon law. <laughs> That's great. I love that. And I bet she's going to hold you to that also. 
That's, yeah, because yeah, you wrote it and you had your hand up and everything. And what happens if the baby wakes up at night? Will you be able to well, help? Well, I wanted to, but my mum said she had pain for nine months, so my dad is going to actually look after the baby. <laughs> says I'll be a bit tired and I do love my plus I do love my sleep so I won't get it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. All right. Well, I got you um, a gift to help you out with your little sister and your little brother and let's bring it out. Right there, <laughs> and then uh, it's yeah, believe. yeah, you have that. There's like there's there's music. There's a little beat. And there's pink cotton candy. And cotton candy. Cotton candy. And you've got a Beats pill. They can listen to hey, music. Right. <laughs> Isn't that amazing? But thank you. Nobody so will much. notice really you on the streets. You'll just you. be unnoticed. <laughs> I know you're here again, and I, I'm so excited too because it is hours away. Like tomorrow, your movie is going to be in stores, and people can buy your movie. I mean, I just, I just can't believe that we've got our own movie. It's just so amazing. We just want to thank you so much for everything you've done for us, Ellen. Oh, you're so sweet, Sophia. Thank you. Thank you so much for thanking me. And. Are you ready to do another movie, maybe? Well, yeah, I'd like to do kind of a scary movie. Maybe a bit like Kindergarten Cop or... Um, <laughs> also, I'd like to do a really, really, really scary movie. But if I did that, there wouldn't be no point of watching it because it'd be too scary. I still would like to do one, though. OK. A lot. OK, well, I'll make sure we get you in a scary movie. Rosie, what would you like to do? Um, I would actually like to di direct um, a movie. Oh. And I would like to do one about my pet. Fluffy. You're going to um, direct a movie about your hamster? Yeah, or I want, and um, I can do a love story. You want to do a love story? What would the love story be? Dancing with a prince. Dance, <laughs> dancing with a prince. That's a fresh love idea. Love story would be good as well. Yeah, but I would, I'm really interested to see the, the movie you'll direct with your hamster. Um, <laughs> They're very difficult to work with, you know. <laughs> very difficult you get a little director's work. chair for the hamster, and it's sitting there with its. All right, let's take a look at uh, you. Actually, uh, we we surprised we had a screening, I know, right? That, that was amazing. Was it fun? I haven't seen it yet. Let's watch I'm it together, so okay? To watch it. All right. Hi, Ellen. We're at St. Brendan's School, and we're just about to surprise the kids with a free screening of our new movie. It's called Sophia Grace and Rosie's Raw Adventure. Number four. We're so excited. The UIP Trojan needed to surprise! Oh, you guys are awesome. I'm your biggest fan. I'm Sophia Grace. And I'm Rosie. And we're taking over your mom. So you can give us some questions. Um, what are your uh, little sister's names going to be? I don't know it yet, but um, I like the names Sparkle and Rainbow and Darren, but my mum doesn't like them. Young man in the glasses. What's it like being on Ellen? And we call her Auntie Ellen. And she's our best friend, and we love her so much. <laughs> hey, because you're such a good teacher, we're going to make you our honorary princess today. Oh my We know you're a big fan of The Ellen Show. And we know you work really, really hard. So Ellen wanted to give you this. It's a day at the spa. Attention, we have to feel grace. And Rosie, school is cancelled. Go to the auditorium to Royal Adventure. Everyone would be 
in and really naughty. They would be like this right now. Do you like your teacher? She, she, sounds, she sounds really nice, better than my teacher. She plays teacher. Um, she puts lipstick on her wall. She's got this wall and she puts lipstick on it. It's just so weird. celebrated your uh, 11th birthday, is it? Yeah. Yeah, 11. And what did you ask for? Well, you see, I'm getting a bit old now, so I didn't really want toys anymore. I want more electrical things, so I wanted maybe, like, um, a computer and a blender, because my baby sister will need a blender soon, and even though it's my birthday, I still want to get gifts for Rosie and my baby sister, just so they feel like they've got presents too. Aww. That is so sweet. And what about if someone had a birthday in your family? Is that Ro Rosie? Yes, it's my pet F Fluffy. Your <laughs> and I gave her a birthday because um, when the baby comes, she might feel a bit left out. She might feel left out, so you wanted to make sure that Fluffy did not feel left out. Aww. And you gave yeah. your hamster a lit candle. <laughs> <laughs> Seems safe. Hey, I got y'all a gift before you go. I'm going to miss you so much. I can't believe you're going back for the summer. But um, I got you something that everyone who has uh, their own movie should have their own movie poster. So I signed a movie poster for y'all to bring back home. Whoa! All right. I can't believe you're back here. This I can't, I can't believe you're back here too. It's been so long. There's no, no more tutus. And I know. It's amazing. So, okay, so how old are you now? I'm 12. 12, and Rosie? I'm nine. Wow. Yeah, I've grown up a lot. You have, and when, when you watch that, do you, can you believe, do you remember all that? I, yeah. I mean, it's just amazing how many memories we have. There's just so much stuff. Yeah, there's, there's a just, lot of stuff. Oh my God. And, and so, do you feel like when you, because you're going to turn 13 when? Yeah. Um, April the 18th next year. 13. And so both of you all changed your mind about boys. You like boys now. Well, kind of. I mean, they're not as disgusting as I thought they used to be. <laughs> they're just, they're just people. They and are. I have got a few friends that are boys in my old school and my new school. And they are, yeah, they're just yeah. people. They're and just... Rosie, you feel the same way you like boys? Um, well, some, I used to think they stunk. Mm -hmm. <laughs> but... I have to deal with it now because I've got a baby brother. I know, that's so exciting. Since you were here last, your parents, your, both your mothers yeah. were pregnant and you have a little sister. Yeah, she's called Belle and um, she's so cute and I really love her, but she has, she has obsessions and addictions. I mean, a few months ago she was obsessed with my new iPhone and then uh, probably a week after that she wants to stick her little finger down my lip balms. Oh, there she is. Uh, <laughs> and how old is she? She's one, and uh, she's going to be two in May. That's, and I know you were really looking forward to that. You really, you were wishing <laughs> for that for Christmas. You wanted your mom yeah, to get pregnant. We did. And you have a little brother now. Yeah, he is so. Oh my gosh. He is so crazy. He's very really funny. <laughs> he loves chocolate, as you can see. I can see that. Um, and. He oh my gosh, loves so me as well. So you're, he lo I bet he loves you. That's so adorable. With their little brother and sister before the show, you brought them out to see the stage. It looks like they're following in your footsteps. Yeah. <laughs> My sister loves dancing. She loves every song out. Yeah. She just, she Maybe they'll it. start doing that. Maybe they'll start singing and dancing. Mm -hmm. Okay, so, Rosie, you had a big day recently, right? Yeah, a Ta massive day. What was it? My mom and dad got married. That's so sweet. That's amazing. <laughs> and... Tell everybody you got really emotional, right? Um, well, at the start, in the ceremony, I got very emotional and I read a poem for my mum and everyone started crying. It, 
Is it something you wrote? Yeah, uh, all by myself. That's really sweet. That's, that's amazing, because I know you wanted him to get married, so that's really sweet. And then you saw a video of your mom. What was that video? Um, um, I went on her iPhone and looked at her bachelorette party. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, what was going on there? Um, I saw all my mom's friends and family in bikinis near the pool. Uh huh. And I saw, at one point, I saw my auntie drinking a massive bottle of vodka. <laughs> That's from, what from the bottle. Yeah. <clears throat> I see. <laughs> Where, did you run out of glasses there? Or? <laughs> wow. A bottle of vodka. A whole That's, bottle. That's crazy. That was a wild party. Um, so Christmas is coming up. What do you all want for Christmas? Um, we want swagways. Swagways. Yeah. Those are difficult to, to maneuver, aren't they? Mm, yeah. yeah. I've, nev I've never been one. I'm yeah. Really has. Yeah. They're very cool. They're hard to get, I right? Really, yeah. They're really hard to get. They're kind of too expensive for yeah. Santa to get us. Yeah, they're kind of expensive. Well, maybe Santa couldn't do it, but I could. So do you want one? No. You're welcome. Great. But don't get Oh my gosh. I don't want to be responsible. You so you're, you're not getting on them yet, but no. you're but they're all blinged out for you. You each have your names on it. Oh my and gosh, thank you. Let me you tell so you much. something else we're gonna do too. Oh good. Safe helmets. Oh that's cool. Oh my gosh. Look at that. Um, my favorite color. So, do you remember the first thing we asked you to do when, the first time you were here, we sent you to the red carpet at the AMAs, right? Yeah. And to talk to all the people that were going to yeah. be performing there? Well, we're going to do it again, because it's Sunday night. We're going to send you to the AMAs. You're going to be on the red carpet. Oh, and... Thank you so much. Hi, Ellen. It's Fear Grace. And I'm Rosie. And today we're at the AMAs. I cannot believe I'm meeting you guys. <laughs> I saw you on Ellen this week, and now I'm meeting y'all. Oh, no. Gigi Hadid. It's Gigi. You guys, I am your biggest fan. Do you want some Skittles? I love some Skittles. Thank you so much. I love your dress. We're all kind of looking like we could be a girl band tonight. Yeah. <laughs> Do you want to show us some model poses? I feel like you guys can show me some poses. That's why I'm living it up. Can nobody tell me different? Can I have one of those? Oh, yeah. Are we allowed? Sure. We don't shots? Is there somewhere I can spend my gum out? Do you have any crushes on any people? Yeah. Ellen, I love you. <laughs> this piece of gum is from a member of Five Seconds of Summer. It could be worth millions. Really, how much do you think it would sell? We're meeting Megan China now! We're meeting Megan China right now! It's strange, isn't yeah. it? It's really weird. I mean, like, 
it must feel weird to walk out. We were so nervous. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I mean, what do you, I mean, I, I don't know if you've seen anything like that recently. Like, I haven't seen it at all. That was Have, such a good montage. It was, I've not it seen was anything so like that recently. Yeah, I mean, you were little girls. You were little, I mean, do you remember the first time you were on? What's your memory yes. of the first time? Well, the first time I was on, we always used to do this thing where we got really nervous. We had nervous bugs. So we used to spit them out and stamp on them before we came, not literally spit them, but sort of get them out and then also we always used to get jamba juice before we came on strawberry and banana smoothies yep. and ronnie the microphone guy he was literally our best friend and we always used to want to get the bigger number and the smaller number because mm -hmm. of our ages so that's definitely some of my memories what do you remember rosie my first memory because i was obviously five years old so i don't remember quite i don't remember a lot but the first thing i remember is obviously Nicki minaj coming out i remember that but i remember seeing her but I, at that point, I didn't know who she was. <laughs> and then it clicked. I was like, oh, Sophia singing this song. Oh, she must be Nicki Minaj, the one singing it. Right. Yeah. So, right. Yeah, because she was more excited, obviously. Yeah, I just stood there. And yeah, just a little bit. You kind of got excited because she was excited, so yeah. you decided that I should be excited. It's so weird because obviously y'all look completely different because you were so young. Your parents look exactly the same. They, they haven't <laughs> changed at all. It's... Oh my gosh, they're going to show up, Harry. Yeah. <laughs> But uh, so, so when you posted the Super Base originally, that's how we found you. Yeah. And it, it's it had like it now it has over 145 million views, wow. I believe. Um, what what made you decide to post that? Well, what happened is as a like child, I always used to dress up, like play dress up. So did me and Rosie. Yeah. Um, and I was dressing up one day, and Rosie's favorite costume happened to be the Virgin Mary. Just you know, Mary and you know Jesus. You yeah, know. I've heard of her. And I had it because I. <laughs> <laughs> Well, I'd done a school play once and I dressed up as it, so Rosie was round, she was wearing the outfit and I'd kept yeah. singing Nicki Minaj all the time and my auntie Danielle, Rosie's mum, was the only one that had an iPhone, so she was like, why don't we film it? Rosie, quickly get out of the Virgin Mary outfit and get into that <laughs> outfit that we had on there. So that's pretty much how it came about. Wow. <laughs> and then we saw you and then... Uh, then the, the and then everything the, else happened. Yeah, and then you <laughs> now we're on the red carpet you, and you hosted Tea Time and yes. you, you met so many different people as we saw, you know, Taylor Swift and Justin Bieber and what, what is your favorite memory of all of that? So my, my favorite memory is with the same person. <laughs> it's with Justin Bieber, obviously. <laughs> so um, the moment when he kissed me on the cheek at the Teen Choice or no, yeah, Kids Choice Awards. Yeah. Uh -huh. And um, obviously at that time I was like, a boy, he's kissing me on the cheek. <laughs> and now I'm like, oh my God, I'd let Justin Bieber kiss me on the cheek again. <laughs> um, <laughs> <laughs> Mine was probably, one of them was definitely with Drake because me and my dad have always been huge fans of Drake and I saw him just casually coming down the Grammy carpet when we was there and I was like, Drake, my dad loves you so much. And we had like a chat with him, he ate some of our candy. <gasps> I haven't seen it. I'm such a big fan of him now. Um, anyway, and the second, like the probably the most core memories, obviously when Nicki Minaj came out and them doors over there when they opened, I literally looked in every single direction but the one that I, yeah. she was coming out of. And then when I finally saw her, it was just chaos. Yeah. And it was great. <laughs> it was good. All great, so all fun. great memories. And then what do y'all want to do next? What's the next thing for you? Well, I'm, I'm focusing on my music at the moment. I actually have a new single that's just come out called Little Things, and the music video has also just come out. Oh, that's there great. It is on there. Congratulations. <laughs> yeah. And Rosie? So, obviously, following In Sphere's footsteps, I am <laughs> releasing a new song. My new song is called Safe. The music video is out as well. And yeah, I'm just, I'm loving so music good. at the moment and focusing on that. That's fantastic. <laughs>